All right, heading right into it. Spiky haired boy and the stonk of causality, but that's the just the uh, helmet I'm wearing. All right. It's the ancient cobalt helmet. I think I'm just gonna go on ahead and sell this thing. What the? What's the buff? Uh, magic crit chance and maximum mana by 40. Okay, so it's the exact same as the jungle hat. Uh, so yeah, let's uh sell it. I mean, it's nice that I did get the ancient cobalt helmet, which is a throwback to the original like, I think beta uh Terraria. Where Cobalt uh, basically gave you the uh, mana, which was basically the endgame mana armor at the time. I've got plenty of cobweb. Oh, right. I also want to see what it is I need to make the Void Bag and Bank. Because I know Bone and uh, Jungle Spores are involved. So, yeah, let me take a look at Jungle Spores. Uh, oh, 12 of each. I don't have enough to make the Blade of Grass. I do have my Ivy Whip, though, so I'm good on that end. Void Bag. Uh, bone, Shadow Scale, Jungle Spores. I don't have enough Jungle Spores. And then the Vault is uh, Bone, 8 Spores, oddly enough, and uh, 15 Shadow Scales. Will contain items picked up by a Void Bag. Carried Pickup. May pick up items when your inventory's full. Okay. So yeah, I guess I'll make a void vault first and then make the uh and then make the void bag later when I get uh, enough materials. So let me pull my shadow scales and uh bone out of the uh bank. Oh yeah, the Ivy Whip has uh three points you can grapple with. Shadow scale and bone. I uh, know I've got bones somewhere. Well, there's some more cobweb. Did I put cobweb in two of these? Oh, there's bone. All right, I got bone. There's Demonite Ore. There's Shadow Scale. I'm also going to turn this into Ore. Okay. Uh, where is the Ore? There it is. Oh, wow. Was able to turn it all. There's the Demonite. Oh, yeah. I also want to make a crown. What do I need to make a crown exactly? Is it just gemstones? So that's super easy. So I do want to make that uh, item summon the... Uh, Slime King. Crafting. I know it's gold bars. Gold crown. Needs a ruby and a gold bar. Okay. Needs ruby and some gold bars. All right. And I think I need to head over to a Demon Forge to make the uh, boss item. Let me check. Because he can tell me what exactly I need. Yeah, I need the Demon Altar. Uh, and it's just 20... Oh, wow, it's just 20 gel. Cool. All right. Uh, gotta go find me a demon altar and make a thing that can uh, bring about the king of all gelatinous masses. 
I will eventually be getting into uh, hell today, but I want to just uh, get some other stuff uh, taken care of. Ooh, there's a sandstorm. Angry Tumbler. <sighs> Haven't seen a Tumbler before. <sighs> I have not defeated 50 Demon Eyes yet. I am shocked. Oh, wow. During a sandstorm, the antlion, uh, enemy types come out. Well, at least I can get antlion mantibles by coming here. Should be, yeah, I'm out of the way of the snow, of the sandstorm. All right, don't mind me, guys. I just need to borrow a uh, demon altar real quick. Ah, perfect. Hope you guys don't mind uh, me just coming in here to just borrow something like this. Uh, where is it? Oh, and a uh, void vault. There we go. Did I need a demon altar to make... Huh, I guess I needed a demon altar to make that, too. Get the hell away from me. Guys want me to come in here and wreck another uh, Eater of Worlds again? Because I can totally do that. There are, there's some good stuff down there. Uh, I've got dynamite on me. Yes, I do. Why cleanse the corruption when you could just blow it up? Also, this is more jungle biome, it looks like. Oh, I can't get to that. I can't get to those gemstones because of the demon altar. Or at least the ones directly below it. Alright. Yeah, I have a specific objective today and I'm going to follow it. Alright, I made my uh, void. I made my void bank and my uh, slime crown. I'm heading back. Uh, mirror. Yeah, I don't need recall potions anymore. Also, let me go on ahead and uh, get some stuff deposited. And you go, and you go, and you go. Uh, one, let's sort that stuff out. If there's something that's uh that I can make with all the uh, gemstones at once. I think there is. I just can't remember. Crafting diamond. A uh, phase blade. And then the phase blades make something. But I mean, since I don't need the robe anymore because I have the jungle armor, I might as well just use those uh, gemstones then, along with the meteorite. Yeah, speaking of meteorite, I can probably head back there and uh, get the rest of the meteorite I didn't get. But that's alright. What I've got's fine right now. Alright, since I don't need to make that robe anymore, I'm going to go on ahead and just... Uh, take the diamond I've got. 
I'm also gonna sell the uh, rope I made. Shop. Sell. Sell. Yeah, I'll sell those too. Sells uh, pretty well. Oh yeah, I've got the silt that I can uh, convert. I didn't get around to doing that. Deposit this radar. Anything else that needs to be deposited? We're going up to the front, buddy. There you go. All right. Obsidian, Obsidian's going in here because I think it's a catalyst that needs to go with a uh, hell, uh, some of the uh, hell ore. Bone and cobwebs going in here as well. I got purification powder. Violent compass. All right, I think I've got everything I want uh, deposited. And I'm going to put the void storage in with the uh, most appropriate NPC. The Dryad. And when I get enough materials to make a uh, void bag, I will. Let me go to Reforge. Uh, let's see what I can do with the Enchanted Sword. Ooh. I don't have much, so that would be only one buff. Uh, what about the magic missile? Annoying. Ah, poop, and I gotta wait. Unless. Okay, Mystic works. Mystic works, I like that. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna go to my arena so I can uh, take. so I can fight the King Slime. All right, King Slime. Oh, it, uh, it's coming in from the left. Oh, and there's a guy uh, trapped. Oh my God, I forgot he could do that. Turns into a lot of blue slime. Oh yeah, this guy's super easy. Oh, he drops his crown every time he uh, reforms in another location. I'm getting a lot of gel for this, that's for sure. Probably enough gel to make another crown. There we go. King Slime has been defeated. And I think I got something. A solidifier. I guess it's a like a gel crafting station. All right, so my spoils overall, I'm up to seven gold. That's good. I got some lead ore. Uh, I guess it was just a lot of gel. I got a ninja hood. Got some tungsten ore. I got a slime gun. Shoots a harmless stream of slime. That kind of makes sense. Oh, I can uh, coat critters in uh, slime, I guess. Yeah, there we go. That's neat. I got some potions. Blue slime banner from destroying a bunch of blue slimes. Yeah, solidifier. I'm curious. Uh, slime blocks. which can be used to create slime furniture. Okay, I see. All right. Well, it's a crafting station of some kind, so I'm keeping it. Uh, Ninja Hood's not really that uh, viable for me anymore, so I'm just gonna sell it. Sell the ore. That was a neat fight. And another, uh, and another boss, uh, under my belt. 
I don't think there's any difference between the safe and the piggy bank. Just one can be placed on the floor, the other can be placed on tables. There we go. Put all my money in there. Alright. Uh, keep everything else. I'm gonna sell the slime gun. It's a vanity thing, and I don't really care for it. Let's deposit this wood I got. Alright, uh, I'll put this in with the guide's room. There we go. Or it's, uh, Bruce's room. Whatever. Alright, uh... Let's see what I get from all this, uh, silt. Got some platinum. And I'm getting a lot of money. I got two gold, and I got all of this. Neat. Oh, I can get rid of the oven stone. I don't need that. Cool. gemstones and whatnot. Uh, yeah, I've got shadow scales here. Alright, cool. Uh, let me check my map. Closest I've come to hell is actually in the jungle, oddly enough. And I haven't been any further, uh, left than this, so maybe there's a second dungeon. Looks like the sandstorm ended. Doing a quick uh, check for a uh, island. Hmm. I could just toss some dynamite. Sweet. That's not the dynamite button, that's the magic missile button. Seeing if there's anything special down here. Nope. Ooh, I could climb up to the top of this. I haven't been to the top of one of these before. Oh, it's apparently high enough for a, uh, for harpies to attack me. Oh, cool. Nice. Ah, 
I hit myself with dynamite because I forgot I threw four instead of three. All right, so it looks like that tree just uh, had absolutely nothing inside of its uh, canopy. All right, let's go beyond uh, the corruption. Also drink. Oh, fine, I'll get some more of this then. I mean, if the game's gonna give me meteorites. Yeah, since I'm going this way, I might as well just get the rest of it. There we go, 150th meteor head. Oh, the meteor heads are getting desperate. leave a little bit of meteorite here because I think I just need to get rid of 80% of it to get the meteorites to stop. Get these things to just stop. Oh, I think they did. Cool. I think I've got just enough meteorite to get them to stop. I guess since uh, having enough meteorite around to, uh, so that it stops uh, regular enemies from spawning, you could use this as a nice uh, viable strategy to collect uh, like Hellstone in Hell. Because it would be nothing but meteorites coming at you instead of the regular uh, denizens. Flames in hell. A lot of flames in the air. This is a uh, another hole. Oh. Oh, I got a burger. A hamburger. Uh, this gives me a major improvements. Okay, cool. Major improvements to all stats it is. All right, haven't been any further than here. So let's go further into the uh, surface jungle biome. Oh God, there's more corruption. Spread a little further than I thought it did. Oh yeah, definitely. I 
If there's a second dungeon in this world, I don't know if I have to fight Skeletron twice. Yeah, here it is. Here we go. I think I'm at the end of uh, the corruption. Uh, I guess this counts as a. Uh, I guess there's only one dungeon. Loot all, take the chest, and get the hell out of here before you start drowning. There we go. Alright, so what at all did I get? I got a breathing greed! Increases breathe time and allows breathing in water. And I got some other mundane stuff. Okay, I'm gonna sell it. Breathing greed, don't care for... Meteor head banner can go away. And turn that into glass. There we are. I'll put my glass inside of uh, one of these. Oh, I've got a lens there. Do I really not have any more? Oh, glass is right there. Cool. All right. Eventually, I'll take some time and uh, get all the stuff reorganized properly. But that day is not today. Do I have enough to make all the phase blades? How much does it take to make one phase blade? Crafting. Uh, 15 and 10, okay. And it re just requires an anvil. All right, yeah, I guess I'll make some phase blades. I can also make some different uh, hooks if I want. But yeah, let me uh, check the materials list then. Crafting. Yellow face sabre. Oh, okay, I can upgrade it to a f face saber. All right, they don't, uh, they don't uh, combine into one omni blade of some kind. But, uh, of these, I managed to make this one the, uh, best one. Alright, cool. I can get rid of the rope coil, don't need that anymore. Got a bunch of sticky bombs in storage. And let me sell these recall potions. I don't think they're going to be uh, useful. Also, do you have the illegal gun parts? You do. It's 22 gold. Yay. And I got a bunch of unholy arrows. I'm not going to need them. I'll just sell them. Boop. Thank you. 
All right, I still need to make the uh, still need to make the leaf uh, blade. Oh, well, I guess I guess uh, after making all of these, I can uh, just uh, keep the one that's the most superior of all of them. Shop. There we go. And I'll deposit the rest of the gemstones. Cool. And quick stat. No. Oh. Sort. Actually, since it's ammunition, I can probably just stick it in an ammo slot. There we go. And the Chester arrows, I think I'm just going to sell. I'm just going to keep one type of arrow on me. I got those from a chest. Then I'll deposit all the money I got. There we go. Ten gold. Oh, yeah. And I want to deposit the rest of the meteorite. All right. I think I'm ready to go to hell. I guess a good jumping point would just be go straight down. Could create a elevator for the hell of it. Nice. Got there just after the explosion happened. little gap right there. Stopping point, rather. Cool. Water's going to be good, because I can potentially create a city and blow me. Cool. Let's go. Heading down into hell. Hey, a bat statue. Ooh, more silk. Cool. Another... Another mine shaft. Oh my god, I actually found diamond. I wasn't even trying. These are sapphires. I did find diamond, though, and I'm satisfied with that. The water bolts swarmed all over it. Oh, good, more cobweb. Got 
a red husk. Hey, it's a boulder trap. I didn't know I set off. Just mass destruction everywhere with this thing. trap. Aha. Uh -huh. I'm not getting hurt by that thing. I'll be getting hurt by another one. Alright. Stay down there or die if you want. Wow, I destroyed a lot of cobweb by doing that. Oh crap, I'm in a spider uh, den. Well, I guess it's not den anymore, it's just... Death. It's just a hole in the ground. Yeah, I think I unintentionally took out all of the uh, spiders before they could spawn. Oh, cool. A uh, web slinger! And it's equipable, apparently. Oh, okay. Is this equip? Yeah, it's equipable. I did not know that I could equip the, uh... Have I always been able to equip things like the Ivy Whip? Ooh. This might actually be a little bit better. And the Ivy Whip. But I think the Ivy Whip has more range. Let me, let me equip the Ivy Whip. I did not mean to delete it. Yeah, the Ivy Whip has more range is the issue. So, I guess the Web Slinger, while nice, just, uh... Wait, the magic mirror is a material? Hmm. Didn't know that. Web covered chest, yep. I was supposed to fight spiders here, but apparently I took them out. They're uh not gonna mess with me. I think I'll leave those guys alone then, and uh, try to just dig down some other way. Another pressure plate, so I guess there was another dart trap somewhere. I was holding the wrong key to move left, and I was wondering why I wasn't. Oh, that's another spider. Uh, I guess it wants revenge on the uh, friends over to the right I killed. Or 
whatever. Nice. Not no enemies could come out of pots. Slime that I couldn't even see because it blends in so well. well I've been over here before, I guess. Oh, this is where I died. I guess I died from, uh, poisoning. Oh, ghost. No ectoplasm? Okay. some of this water down with me. Alright, my 50th piranha. Let's uh, go on ahead and just keep blasting down lower. There we are. Oh, hey, look, obsidian. Very nice. There we are. Nice little breathing hole. Oh god. I did not mean to do that. Well, the good news is I created a uh, bigger hole for lava. All right, so I don't accidentally throw dynamite again. I'm equipping the water bolt. Ran out of air. Infinite Obsidian Generator. There we are. Oh, 
Oh god. Losing a life. Alright, so overall, that created... How much obsidian? After I get rid of all this stuff I don't want to keep. Where is the obsidian? 110. Not bad. Oh, there's a wall creeper there. Well, getting hit by slow moving dot, uh, water bolts is probably the uh, most appropriate thing I can think of for killing it. Another, uh, pit of lava. Great, nice little air hole. There we are. Toss and dynamite in. Completely out of uh, dynamite. Never thought I'd see that happen. There we are. There we are. I now have a spot to get some more obsidian. I think this is actually the uh, most efficient way to get the most uh, obsidian as possible. And I better uh, go up for air again. I know at a certain point, uh, you, uh, aren't able to take, uh, water with you to place in, uh, on the ground because it just evaporates from being too hot. More obsidian. Oh, there's a lot of spiders over there. I didn't even know I had one of those potions on me. Oh, 
Oh, cool. Alright, so it might be a good idea not to take out this obsidian just yet. Because I've got a nice little uh, breathing hole here. How much obsidian do I have now? Oh yeah, skyrocketed. 297. There's supposedly a hole here, so I'm gonna check that out. And this pool is sucked up. Alright, we're in the hell biome. Or well, we're right above it, rather. I destroyed absolutely everything. God, so much cobweb. Am I near a mushroom biome? There's a gem tree. Amethyst and an amethyst gem core and a lot of stone. Oh god, that was a boulder. I don't think I want to go that way. Oh, cool. Got rid of all the water. Keep going. There we go. Got it all. Very careful over here because lava. Yeah, I'm near a mushroom biome. Did not know that. Yeah, an entirely different mushroom biome. And it's near lava. Get rid of the dirt and mud. I got a fried egg! Cool. And a bunch of... Oh, those aren't chests. I thought they were. That's just a menu UI. Things keep going into the uh, lava. Ah, since I've got this pool of uh, lava here... I wonder if I can just do this.
Oh, bad idea, bad idea, bad idea. <sighs> Should have created a larger hole for myself. Oh, I didn't lose very much money, and it uh, automatic automatically gets destroyed if it uh, falls into lava. But it's honestly not that much of a loss. I'll just quick stack what I got. Alright. Sell some stuff. Get rid of the bat statue. I got some silt. Rope. Red husks. Got a lot of cobweb and a lot of obsidian. Got a buttload of stone, but I don't need it. How much for the web slinger? Oh, not too much. Yeah, Ivy Whip's definitely better. Although the web slinger is definitely a uh, poor man's... A poor man's Ivy Whip, I guess? Now that I think about it, I have seen the web slinger before in the game. Deposit all this in. Let me try reforging something. I've got enough, I could. Less knockback, but uh, pretty good stats otherwise. Alright, I'll take it. All right, let's head back into the abyss. Let's see if I can remember the path I made. Oh God. There we go. I now have a straight shot down into water. Hey, I got a traveling merchant. Oh, I got some more money. Okay. Also, let me see what this traveling merchant has. Shop. Portable cement mixer. Places... Increases wall placement speed. And it's a material? Ammo box. I do not have any money on me, basically. A cement mixer is a material for something, but I don't have enough money to get it. That sucks. I do have a bit of that, though. Alright, heading back down. He's got some pretty good stuff this time around. Oh, right, I wanna... I'll spend the rest of my money on dynamite. Uh, where is that demolitionist? There he is. Alright, Dolgan. Alright, let's go. So the location of enemies might be pretty good. I'm going straight into water. There we go. Cool. Or cobweb. Hey, I got some more silt here. Definitely going to be collecting a lot of silt until... Basically until after I beat the wall of flesh. 
Because I think all those materials basically, in unless it's a very uh, niche case, become absolutely useless. Alright, Mother Slime. There we go. All those things are done. Is that obsidian? Yes, it is. I missed some obsidian. Let's try the, uh, lava pool again. Oh, there's a, uh, webbed stylist. Alright, well, I've got the stylist unlocked. Need to get another, uh, place set up for her, then. I guess more importantly, now that I have, uh, this thing set up, I guess I can, uh, make my own, uh, little obsidian dispensary. Yeah, basically have a, uh, an obsidian dispensary. Need to be a little bit careful over here. I'll basically go until I get a full stack of 999. Oh god. And I'm running out of air. Her name's Flora. Go until I just uh, use up all the lava up to the uh, ground point I've got. There we go. And that's all the lava on there. digging. Yeah, I've got to be close to hell. This is, uh, lava grass, I think. 
And I think I need Fire Bloom in order to... Which can be found in Hell to be able to make Fireproof Potions. Do these evaporate? They don't. Cool. Make it safe for me to fall down there. Very nice. Oh, uh, wasn't quite safe. At least this nice little uh, lava fall effect doesn't hurt me. I hope. Ah, there's hell. Alright, made it. Any fire blocks I come across, I'm gonna be uh, immune to the damage they uh, deal to me. I also need to be careful about what uh, falls into the lava here because there's some... Uh, and there's some, uh, flying imps that can sometimes carry a, uh, guide voodoo doll, and if they drop it over lava, you're screwed. Because that summons the wall of flesh. Oh, it's fire blossom, not fire bloom. Yay, bone dragon. I got a battle potion. I'm also looking for uh, pockets of Hellstone. Oh, that was close. Hellfire arrows! Those are going to be useful. Oh, there's one. I need to catch this voodoo doll. Okay. Alright, some health. Got a healing potion. Basically trying to find a uh, spot that I can uh, get to to mine some uh, hellstone. And I think I found one right here. I also need to be very careful about where I mine. Because these produce lava after I um, mine them. Alright. Luckily, these aren't, uh, absorbed into, uh, lava like everything else. And, of course, I can't place that, so that hellstone is lost to me! Unless... Alright, be careful where you mine. You don't want to drop lava on you. This one right here, don't mine. Alright, I'm still good. Okay. Gonna cover up that hole. Where's my stone? There we are. Yeah, nice little bit of lava. Getting a little hot around the collar, it seems. Obsidian sofa. Hmm. Didn't know it came in obsidian.
There's a Hellfire Forge. Gonna need that later. A Hellforge. Oh, that was just an obsidian vase. I thought it was a giant, uh... pot that contained stuff. Oh, and it's, I can store stuff in, that, in an obsidian dresser. Didn't know you could store stuff in dressers in this game. They work like they do in real life. Oh, that's neat in the background. There's a bunch of uh, bats flying. Close. All right, how much hellstone did I get? Okay, 21. The uh, Hellstone Forge is basically just a upgraded uh, forge. I won't need the regular forge anymore, since the Hell, since uh, the that forge will work just fine for everything. Flying imps, uh, in addition to sometimes being, uh, holding a, uh, guide voodoo doll, also have another one of the most powerful spells, uh, pre-wall of flesh. And I'm hoping I can get it. Obsidian bed, I finally have a bed. Alright, get the hell away from me. Or, get the surface away from me since I'm in hell. Alright, how many Hellfire Arrows I've got? Ooh, 124. Hellfire Arrows also uh, can set uh, enemies on fire. to the hellstone over here. Hmm. It's actually not a bad idea. I'm going ahead and uh, get rid of these doors. Put some ash blocks. give myself a little bit of breathing room. Oh, the water bolt's gonna serve me so well here. didn't help much. Alright. I'm gonna go on ahead and do that. Alright. All done over here. Plenty of hell forges, and I think I can sell them. I'm also going to be cutting a uh, swath through uh, held and uh, creating a uh, walkable surface to fight the wall of flesh in. Since that's a very good strategy. Ooh, okay. Oh god. Flaming Imp. There we go. J oh, it's a regular demon. I think I'll be starting from the uh, right side and going to the left. Alright, you didn't have the thing I wanted, so I'm gonna keep going. Getting a lot of healing potions. I'm 
kind of glad I don't have a water candle on me, or else I'd be really hard-pressed to try to get stuff while fending off stuff. Yeah, I just want enough health stone to be able to get the next, uh, mining, uh, mine pick. And then I'll work on getting all the stuff set up for the Wall of Flesh. Oh, it's a bathtub. And not really any need for, uh, torches down here. That hurt. Alright, didn't drop it. Let's keep going. Still looking for that other, uh, best spell in the game. Pre, uh, pre Wall of Flesh. I need a shadow key, and I don't think I got one while I was in the, uh, dungeon. Which sucks, because these are pretty good things in here. There must have been a chest I missed, uh, when I was in, uh, the dungeon, because you get the shadow key from there. I think. Alright, another fire blossom. Dropping gold. Pots will do that sometimes. Hey, a chair. Alright, here's another batch I can mine. Why'd you have to go and do that? All right. All right, get over here, please. There we go. Hello, how are you? Currently, I'm in hell for uh, all the sins I committed on the surface, and I'm uh, doing some eternal mining to hopefully face a wall of flesh so that I can uh, be forgiven given of my sins and go up to a new brand, a brand spanking new world. Yeah, I'm on 1.4. I'm on journey's end, basically. Oh God. Another demon. Hey, thanks for the follow. I appreciate it. This demon wants to get at me, but he doesn't realize there's a wall in the way. But I want to get at him because he has a good spell. Alright, get in the hole. I know you can do it. There you go. didn't drop it. It's a rare drop, though. Is that a... That's a hell butterfly. Huh. Alright, how much hellstone do I have? 54. That's nowhere near enough.
Okay. I'm still looking for a hell of a lot more Hellstone. Ooh, Obsidian Skin Potion. I think that makes me immune to lava. I definitely want to grab that. Uh, yeah, provides immunity to lava. Cool. I got something useful. Uh, keeping the hellstone. Well, I've got a hellforge. I could probably just place it there and make the bars I need. Alright, that's 19. I don't have enough. Let's take the forge with us then again. Alright, the Met Traveling Merchant has left, and I missed out on a couple of good things because I didn't have enough cash at the time. There's a nice little chamber down there with a piano. All right, uh, I could use this potion just to have a good opportunity to get some, uh, good stuff. Get some, uh, good veins of hellstone. Oh, another demon. And he didn't drop it either. Yeah, the, those, uh... Those blade-looking things that those, uh, demons are firing off, I can actually get that as a spell of my own. And I'm kind of hoping I actually do. It's a very good spell. I'm getting a lot of bombs, and that's not a bad thing at all. up on everything that oops Did that mess up with... Did that mess with the window I don't think it did <gasps> yeah it did ah shoot all right let me uh change rechange the resolution I accidentally uh resized the window video 1280 by... There it is. Cool. Alright, everything looks normal now. More bombs. That's good. Ah, uh, the full... Gonna get the full furnishings of hell without actually being in there on the surface. No count unavailable. Some things must have dropped a lot of gold then. I never died there, so couldn't be that. City and workbench. Oh, good. I can actually... Can I make an anvil? I need some sort... I need some lead. Or maybe I can make a uh, hellish one. Let me get the workbench back on. Alright, uh, let's see what I can make. Well, I've got another obsidian skull for something. Oh, battle potion.
potion. I do not want that. I do not want an increased spawn rate. I'm not doing one of the situations where it would be beneficial to have one. Actually, it might be beneficial to have one just so I can have a better chance of getting the, uh... The, uh, spell I want. Getting a boatload of healing potions. I can get these easily. Nothing of worth over here. I guess just try to find the uh, biggest uh, batches of hellstone that are in lava and then just use the obsidian skin potion there. God, so much red. I'll just let that fall. Alright, cool. It's gonna let the lava fall down there safely while I collect the rewards. Nope. That was a bad idea. I can get this one. There we go. Alright, where's my Hellforge? There it is. It's a material. That's interesting. A Hellforge is a material. I guess it was uh, made a material in a uh, patch I never experienced. A little bit of a jungle biome over here. I guess I can go back up and get some jungle spores if I want. Yay, that's my 50th hell bat. And I'm out of uh, space. What do I get rid of? Uh, I can get rid of the battle potion. I don't want it. Ask her to get rid of the table. I'm keeping the bed, because that gives me a home point. Stop it. There we go. Oh god. Oh god. Very nice. More. 
more money. More chests that I can't open because I don't have a shadow key. Oh. Uh, oh my god, I dropped a lot of money. That sucks. That was basically half of what I had. Oh well. Let's quick stack it. Keeping all of those, and I'm definitely keeping the Fire Blossom. Hellstone Brick, Obsidian Brick, that can go away. Yeah, this is going to be a useful little thing. Oh, cool. Extendo Grip. Stopwatch. Life form analyzer. I don't have one of those, and I don't have a uh, stopwatch. Cool. Interesting that this is a material. I did not know that. Oh good, Blood Moon. Oops. Cell phone! Displays everything. Allows you to return home at will. I assume the PDA is what uh, is made from every single thing. That displays like a radar and whatnot. Another blood moon, son of a bitch. It's kind of hoping I wouldn't be encountering one of these for a while. These are even deadlier post wall of flesh. Oh, there you are. They can't get us now. So I think I'm gonna use this time to actually work on some uh, stuff. Eh, yeah, screw it, I'll sell the bed. This will always be my home. I don't really have any intention of changing it anytime soon. Keeping the guide voodoo doll because it's gonna be useful for something. Oh, I got a hook. Uh, keep you. Yeah, I'm gonna replace the forge I have with a hell forge. It's gonna be super useful. No rare creatures nearby. That's good to know. All right, let's take some items out.
depth meter. DPS meter. All right, let's see what I can make. I can make goblin tech. I can also create the, uh... Wreck 3000. Get rid of that. Cool. Oh, displays the number of monsters, kill count, and rare creatures. I'm going back out there. Halfway done with the moon. Some more rocket boots. All right, so let's see. Movement speed, DPS, valuable ore. Monsters kill count, rare creatures. So I still need a depth meter. Another fallen star. Got two obsidian skulls for no reason. Oh, one of them gave me a top hat. Ripplers can go away, please. Monsters kill count rare creatures. Let me uh, sort and then I'll deposit. There we go. And goblin tech. Monsters, kill count, rare creatures. I don't need any tally counters anymore. I don't think. God, I've got so many compasses and everything else. Probably unnecessarily. Everything's getting blown up. <sighs> Fleshy zombies. After this blood moon, I'm gonna take a quick break. Alright, 
taking the fight away from my, uh, NPC companions. Because if I don't, then I put them at risk of death. And I don't want them to die when I don't want them to. Zombie, yay! I get a uh, commemorative banner every 50th kill. Oh, Blood Moon's done. Money that they dropped. Okay. All right, let's uh replace this stinky old thing. Also, let me see what the health health forge is a material for. Then I'll probably take a quick break. Uh, crafting. What are you for? Titanium Forge and... Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's right. Well, I can sell the regular furnace then. Alright, I'm gonna take a quick break and when I get back we're gonna... See what uh, else I can combine using the Tinker's Workshop, and then I'm heading back into hell. <laughs> 